Hello goat lovers, this is our year in review. We had five new additions to our herd in 2018. Anna and Elsa were two of them. We purchased them in January and they were potentially bred. Elsa threw triplets, but Anna has been difficult to get bred. We also retained Mayo from our best doe May. And Cassie from our best milker Camden. Two great additions. Can't wait to see what they give us in 2019. They are bred to our fifth edition, Everest. Everest is from Elsa and backed with superior genetic lines. He brings new blood to our herd and we can't wait to see the improvements he brings. In January, our garden was nothing but a pile of compost the goats gave us. By March, we had two beds sprouting, but still had to worry about frost. In April, the garden really took off. Everything was growing good. Spring was in full force and we couldn't wait to start eating out of the garden. By May, we had enough to eat. We could eat every day from the garden and we have eaten every day from the garden since then. Not to mention milk and cheese. By the end of July, we had enough dirt for two more beds, and we planted them in August. By the end of October, we, add, we had added on another bed to each end. and the garden had taken on a new shape. All of this was built with recycled materials, stuff we brought with us from our last house or stuff I brought home from work. Almost all of our seeds were saved from our last garden. It's so nice to know where our food comes from and so rewarding to grow it with our family. It is probably no secret that one of my favorite things to do is go to a goat show. This is the time of year baby goats are in abundance, udders are full and beautiful, and you get to show off your herd and see how they stack up to other goats. The knowledge gained at a goat show is priceless. All the friendship gained at goat shows with like-minded, hard-working, good people is also very priceless. The kids work hard, and of course it's always nice to win. We did pretty good in the 2018 year. In total, we took home 12 ribbons. May won two best of breeds. Bindi took one grand champion and two reserves. Shilly took a grand champion and the best in show. Little Lady, who we sold, took reserved grand champion. And Lucky took four reserve grand champion wins.
we were also able to take some bucks to the show this year. They get a little rowdy. Let's all take a moment and appreciate how gorgeous Lucky is right here. Getting excited for next year's already. So it's been a pretty good year. Uh, you guys have helped us go from 500 subscribers in January to ending this year with almost 7,000 subscribers. So we want to thank you guys so much for all the support, for all the comments, all the thumbs up, uh, supporting us by purchasing through the Amazon links, all of that stuff. Um, you certainly, certainly have inspired us to continue to make videos and it's all worthwhile because of you guys. You've also inspired our children, Emily and Darren, uh, to start their own YouTube channels as well. So been a pretty good year. Thank all of you guys so much and we will see you again next year.